All right, um, so that is Ton Todike, first of all, a politician that is hoping to hold public office very soon. So that thing happened in Meitama. That particular video was sent to me by my friend. He said the thing happened on Wednesday and he was an eyewitness. He was there and he saw everything. So he sent it to me. It's like, video. the reason why I sent it to you is that they are trying to abuse power on this guy and they are trying to show him that they have connection. If you watch the video properly, um, Toto DK says something like, um, because of 2 million, you want to seize my 6 million era car? I will show you that I own this Abuja. Da, 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 da. So let me explain what happened. There are more videos. I'll put more videos here so that you can see this. You can see what you can see the human being that Tonto DK is. Do you understand? Now, according to the story, because I've not spoken with the guy yet. Now, my guy where did here and I didn't send them to me. So, according to the story, Tonto DK came to this guy. She said she saw a Mikano car somewhere. So, um, but the price they told her was very expensive. So she came to this guy called Skywise Group in Mitama and she told the guy that, please, I need this car. I like it. You understand? She told the guy that she liked the car. The guy said, I don't have it, but Mikano have the car. So they went there, they priced the car and the car was 90 million there. So Tonto DK said she want to do instrumental for Mikano. Then Mikano said, ah, they don't collect instrumental. She said she will pay in three months. Mikano said they don't collect instrumental. So this particular guy now said, okay, since i'm a car dealer i own a very big car business in abuja let's create a relationship i will buy you the car then you you can do that three months payment for me there's no problem so they now give the guy discounts because the guy has partnership with mecano they now give the guy discounts so everything was now 86 million naira. the guy now collected the car paid complete 86 million and gave to the car do you understand just to create a relationship Toto DK now dropped 30 million Naira, remaining how much? 56 million Naira. So as she dropped the 30 million, the guy gave her the car. First month passed, no installment was paid. Second month, third month, fourth month, no installment was paid. You understand? So the guy now said, ah, what's going on? Before I know it, in this thing, only seven months, no installment was paid. One day, after much pressure, Toto DK now brought the car. She now came, now she should go and bring money for them that they should wait. She now eventually go and bring 20 million Naira. When she brought 20 million naira, she now carried the car. How much can remain? It can remain uh, 36 million naira. From there on, Tonto DK will not pay. She will bring 1 million, bring uh, this one, bring small, small money, bring small, small money. Eventually, the money can't reach 2 million naira. It now remains 2 million. So that same person they've been calling now oh, since last year oh, till now. Eventually, she now says, she now called this same guy now and say, I want to service the car. The car needs servicing. Change oil and all that. The guy said, No, Wahala. They now collected the car. They now took it to Mikano. When they did service at Mikano, they now said, ah, we need some money to pay them for servicing. And also, we we'll appreciate if you give us our balance today. According to the story, Tonto Dike now sent the guy a message and told him that he will see that I am mad today. According to the story, they said the guy did not believe anything. The guy went out only for Tonto Dike to come to his office. My brother, I saw Tonto Dike start. Do you understand? Then they now called the guy. They now called the guy to tell the guy that ah they are scattering your office. So the guy now came. See Tonto DK. So wait, before then they said the guy now told Tonto DK that you are scattering my office. You understand? Why are you scattering my office? You have not completely paid for this car. I can collect this car back because your name is not even on it. It was me that collected the car. Do you understand? It was me that collected the car. Um, on so they say Tonto DK jump was this guy. Start to the drag the guy shit. Watch. As you can see, see the way she started dragging the guy. Oh, yeah, make the refund. Our friends come the ginger. Oh, yeah, make that refund. We must collect the refund after you don't use the car for almost one year. After you don't use the car for almost one year, just two million naira, you start to scatter the guy's office. See the end result. She scattered the guy's TV, messed the place up. 
Do you understand? She messed the place up. This same person, they talk about bullying for Mubad. This same person, they talk about, eh, they were bullying. This same person, they talk. I told you people that you people don't know all these people. Do you understand? This is how she goes around. They abuse power. This is clear abuse of power now. This is abuse of power because you are now close to some politicians. You want to just take it on on people. It's not fair. Nigerians, need I remind you, if this was somebody else, if the man do this thing to a woman, nobody for your word. Do you understand? Nobody for your word. But now, hoping she will use her connection to get out of it. Do you understand? Now, see this part. Again. Who is person asking the police to go? Yeah, if you are kneeling down for us. Yeah, first. Yeah. See now. See. But it's good. No, it's uh, what are you saying? This bush is now. at the wrong side of the law, like this, with all this. Okay. It's good. So as you can see in the video, those people were begging her. You can hear the voice notes. That is my guy. Now that my guy now they talk. The one that entered the place when the team was crazy, he entered the place. He was the one that videoed everything and sent it to me, right? So he now was not even saying, Why they not even was that? He to say they was that she for calm down. Do you understand? Now you did wrong. Now you come on the scatter person office. And you can see the the guy's staff, the skywise guy staff, then he down the back door to the gate. They were begging her, almost she refused. Do you understand? She refused because she has the connection. Do you understand? And now this same person now won't enter power. Imagine what she never get power now. She doesn't have political power now. She what she's doing. Imagine if somebody like Tonto Dike gets political power in Nigeria. Just imagine the terror. Imagine what common people will face. Do you understand? Imagine what ordinary people will face in the hands of the lives of Tonto. Imagine what Tonto Dike will do when she eventually get political power. We don't finish with that. Do you understand? And guess what? The sad part about this is that she can get away with it. Do you understand? She will get away with it. That's the funniest part. She will get away with it. Do you understand? Imagine saying now, man, I ain't bitter like that. Or I ain't harass her like that. On top of your own money. This is on top of his own sweat. On top of his own sweat. And guess what? They even said that she even promised the guy that she would do advert for him. She did not do the advert. The guy did not even bother. That, that's why the guy went spread her and said, Come, it's not even you that have this cassette. Don't make me collect them. And you come scatter my shop on top. In short, I can pay your money and you go. Next thing, they change case for this guy. I start to be gathered and they beat them. It's not fair. It's not fair. We are trying to end bad government. This is the bad government we are talking about. Tomorrow now, you go appoint this one now, Minister of Humanitarian. Because I guess that is why she's doing humanitarian on her page. Give her humanitarian now. We don't finish. We don't finish. This is part of the bad government we are talking about. And bad government, now this ones that they talk about. Because if she get power now, we are done. But anyways, I know she's very well connected. We'll put the right measure. I heard that the guy has submitted the report at the Metama police station. I know say she get connection, so the team feel no work. Do you understand? But we will still do letter, go IG of police, so that they can investigate the case properly. And also to human rights people. You understand? I'll take it to all the human rights offices so that they can investigate. Then that's when we'll know that if the law truly really works in Nigeria, or if it is connection that works in Nigeria, because like I said, she will get away with this. She will get away. I can beat my chest to say she will get away with it. Because there are people in power that might stand behind her. This is what Nigeria has turned to now. Do you understand? Like I said, she will get away with it. She will. Hey, now wow. Don't do DK change. Tomorrow night, you are fighting against bullying. It is Ojoaya at the end of the day now. If you fight against bullying in public, then behind, you are doing it to people. It is Ojoaya. But God in high heaven is watching you. God in high heaven is watching the likes of you. Nigeria is our country and everybody have the rights. Okay, so I just feel that this disgrace is not even enough for Tone to Dike. Like, they could have done something more to her. I, I don't understand. A lot of people out there protesting and Tone to Dike came out to say nonsense on her page. As if she's not feeling the pain. If she's not feeling the pain, then why is she not able to pay for the cash she got? Anyway, all of us go collect. She be as to one start for a um, bad government. All of us go collect. Mona, no worry. People think because you're celebrities or because you're making noise for this government that you no go collect. Ngwa, pay for the car you are owing. <laughs> Don't play or you learn and you learn the hard way. People they suffer, they talk nonsense.